Yo, what's good, yo? Let me spit some knowledge for you real quick. quick. Alright. So you're in the womb for nine months. Triple darkness. Right. There's nine moons. I mean nine planets, my bad. Nine planets. Also, nine is an infinite number. The highest number. Atoms consist of 99.99 empty space right the shape of an arc is a nine nine is also the spiral of the universe 369 Fibonacci now that's where you get your divine feminine nine feminine energy we all come from that portal the womb now the woman is shape of a nine okay it's also where you get your crook from like the crook and flare that the nisu bitty or the pharaoh holds right this is nine mathematics supreme mathematics all right so now after the nine it goes to the ten which ten is just a one and a zero right back to cipher Truly, one cannot come from zero. If you go read three guys' book, how did one come from zero, you will realize that this is all an illusion. And I mean, that makes sense when you observe quantum physics, the observer's effect, the double slit experiment, right? And how atoms consist of 99.99 empty space. Okay, so it was sound waves, vibration, frequency, energy that manifest into the physical, right? Because in the beginning was the word, and the world, the words create worlds because the tongue is a sword. Now, the world was shapeless and formless, it was darkness, it was void. Right, and God said, "Let there be light." A tomb, right? The atom, or atom, right? So, so what is light? Okay, well, before the word is the thought. So God, or the source, is thought. Now, feminine energy, right? The womb man, right? She represents the triple black matter chaos 